Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Ines. I do beauty videos, mummy videos, all sorts of things. So I would love for you to subscribe. Today I'm doing a first impressions and makeup review type thing on the Barry M liquid chrome highlighter drops. They are brand new, but I just picked up two. I got Beam Me Up and um, At First Sight. And I got this um, pink one, but it looked more neutral in store, where I'm seeing it now, it's a lot pinkier. So I don't know if I'm gonna love it, just because I don't really like pink highlights. But we'll give it a go. I think today I'm going to use this one, which is a little bit more like champagne-y coloured. The other one, like I said, was bronzier. And then there was a, like a fluorescent -y white, which I knew I'd never wear. Uh, so I left it. Was there three? I think there was four. Yeah, there was four. Yeah. And when I got there, um, they had this like deal. I got them from, from Super Drugs. And if you spent seven pounds on Barry M products, they would give you this little lip scrub and they had the marshmallow one or a strawberry one and they chose the marshmallow one. I'm actually gonna smell it because I haven't opened it yet. I normally use the Lush lip scrub and I love it. So I wonder if it's just like similar to it. Oh my gosh, it smells exactly the same. Not exactly the same. The other one from Lush is butter popcorn that I get. Toffee popcorn. And they smell quite similar. <sighs> if you've ever had that, then, and you like it, then try this one because it's quite similar. And I, I thought strawberry might be a little bit too sweet for me. So yeah, let's just get started. I'm going to try this one. Um, let me just see what it looks like, even though I've seen it already, but and that is like just pigment that is so nice. I'll show you guys the other one just so you can see it. So that is, I've forgotten it already, Beam Me Up, and then that one is At First Sight. I don't know if it's coming out on camera, but in person it's like pink. So I'm going to pop it straight onto the skin. I think that'll be like the easiest way to do it. Oh. I don't know if that's a lot. That's how much I'm using. I think it is a lot. I'm going to pop it down the bridge of my nose and could do my cupid's by but got lipstick on already so I don't really want to if it's a little bit too much I might go in with my Beauty Blender. Oh, that is so pretty. <gasps> that is so nice. Oh, God. That is pigmented. That is really pretty, though. It's like a... I would say natural shine, but it's definitely like highlighting. I'm gonna take some off because it is really, really nice. I'm really impressed. So it's definitely like beaming at you. It's 
so first impressions i really like it it's not glittery at all like it's got really it's like a shine and i love that like i don't really like glittery highlights so this is really pretty it's such a nice color it's a very champagne color which i think would suit a lot of skin tones again that was the beam me up if you're a little bit darker than me then you might want to go for the i can't remember what it was called but it's the one i wanted originally um but it was just a little bit too bronzy but it's just stunning so i'm just going to finish off my makeup i weren't sure if i was going to put highlight on top or not but with any other product i would put highlight on top so i'm going to use something that i think is quite close and that is the mary luminizer by the bottom i'm just going to put it on top just to set that highlight throughout the day i was going to use champagne pop but i think but i don't know if you can i mean it's like an in-betweener but i think i'll use the balm because i love it right now so i'm just going to pop it directly on top of that highlight And just to finish off my makeup, I'm going to add some blush and I'm going to add Pleasure Model by MAC. I think I'll zoom you guys in so you can see it. So I'm going to wear it for a couple of hours and then I'll come back, see how it wears, see how I feel about it and finish the video. Hi guys, so it's about, I don't know what time is, it's six o'clock so I've worn it for seven hours. Um, I find that it still stayed on really nicely, it looks shining overall is a great product uh, i do recommend it the color that i used was just so pretty i just re-switched it and it's just stunning um compared to the pink you can see that the pink is quite pink um so i might mix them together because i know i wouldn't use the pink but on its own but yeah that's it i like it it's lasted really nicely i would wear it again so i hope you enjoyed the video have a lovely day bye